Hi, I'm Brian Mace, a product manager in Lincoln Electric's Advanced Technology Products Group. Today I'm here to introduce an expansion to our dress out kit portfolio. Here we have our new dress out kit on a Fanuc 100 ID robot arm. When we talk about a dress out kit, we talk about all the connections between the J1 axis or the base of the robot and the J3 axis where the wire feeder mounts. So here we have our dress out kit in an enclosed hose pack. This hose pack is carrying the weld cable, water cooling lines, gas, as well as communication to the wire feeder. The dress pack includes a ball joint and a clamp style system. The clamp attaches to the robot using the factory recommended accessory bolt holes. The ball joint fits into the clamp like this and then you simply clip it closed and then secure with the locking tab. The conduit can move around inside of the clamp to increase the lifespan of the conduit as well as the cables inside. As we work our way up the robot arm, we are using a side mount termination up near the wire feeder. This increases the range of motion of the robot arm as opposed to the conduit going around the front of the J3. Let's go to the other side and take a look at a couple more things. The cables exit the conduit up at the J3 axis and pass between the wire feeder and the back of the robot arm. There's a plastic insulator to protect the back of the robot. As the cables travel down, they go through a series of ball joints that we mentioned before, and the conduit goes into the J1 axis bore. The conduit extends a few inches down to protect the cables from rotational stress. As the cables come out the bottom, they terminate into a bulkhead. The bulkhead is where all of the cables can be easily disconnected from the rest of the system. This is to aid in periodic maintenance. Let's go over to the bench and take a look at some components in further detail. The components and assemblies shown here on the bench are representative of what the customer will receive when they order a dress out kit. Starting with the corrugated tube hose pack, the ball joints are pre-assembled in their proper locations along the length of the hose pack. Inside the hose pack, the water, wire feeder cable, and super high flex 4 aught welding cable are pre-installed at Lincoln Electric, making installation super simple at the integrator site. Moving on to the brackets, the brackets are also pre-assembled with the necessary fittings and hardware. We have water, gas, and welding cable. The ball joint brackets are also assembled to their sheet metal brackets which mate with the robot arm. All of the brackets are easily assembled to the robot arm using a cardboard backer hardware diagram. The hardware is laid out with photos of exactly where to install the brackets and which hardware to use. We use three sizes of metric hardware, totaling five tools to assemble this dress out kit to a Fanuc robot arm. All of these things combined results in an approximate assembly time of around 25 minutes. Keep a lookout as we expand the dress out kits to further robot arm models. For more information, visit lincolnelectric.com.